Good morning students. I am Nirali Chetloja from Srimati Jaya Patel Mela Science College, Morbi. So today your lecture or topic name is Bidelo Vibrio. It's the last genera in aerobic microaerophilic gram negative bacteria mortality legal and vibrio. So now we're going to start Bidelo Vibrio. Bidelo Vibrio. This is last genera. So now these are aerobic bacteria. Bidelo Vibrio. These are aerobic bacteria. It means they need oxygen for their growth. It means need oxygen. Right. And with Vibrio itself, Bidelo Vibrio are Vibrio itself. In a say Vibrioid. You all are studied in a previous lecture. Vibrio itself. And Bidelo Vibrio possess a single polar flagellum possess single polar flagellum it means single Polar flagellum. Not the both the side of cells, but only one side. And Bidelo Vibrio are unique cells or unique bacteria. Why? Bidelo Vibrio are unique cells or bacteria. But why? Question was that Bidelo Vibrio are unique. But why it is unique? Because Because They are Parasitic They are parasitic on other gram negative bacteria so Bidelo Vibrio are unique but why it is a unique because they are parasitic or on other gram negative organism they are parasitic And it occurs or present in present in soil, sewage, fresh water or in marine environments. Right, so now we are going to start or focus on a life cycle of Bidelo Vibrio. Life cycle of Bidelo Vibrio. Six stages are there. 
लाइफ साइकिल विद डेलो विब्रियो सिक्स स्टेजेस आर देयर एंड द होल लाइफ साइकिल टेक्स अबाउट फोर आवर्स the whole life cycle takes about 4 hours so now we going to start life cycle of मिडेलो विब्रिय इन फर्स्ट स्टेज मिडेलो विब्रियो अटैच टू होस्ट सेल सो स्टेज नंबर वन For example, this is host cell. विब्रियो अटैच दिस इज बीडेलो विब्रियो दिस इज बीडेलो विब्रियो एंड दिस इज अस्ट सेल एंड नॉन फ्लेजलेटेड पार्ट ऑफ द बीडेलो विब्रियो अटैच टू होस्ट सेल दिस इज होस्ट and this is middle of embryo right and this is cytoplasmic membrane cytoplasmic membrane and this is cell wall so in the first stage only middle of embryo attached to host cell so in the stage 1 attachment of middle of embryo to host cell then after stage 2 penetration occurs it means non flagellated part of the bidella vibrio penetrate in a periplasmic space non flagellated part attached to periplasmic space right in a third space third stage bedeloplast formation is occurs so now stage number 
Life cycle of Bidel Vibrio, stage three. Bidel Plast Formation. Bitiloplast formation, it means without flagella, Bitilovibrio enters into the periplasmic space Most cells are round. And all middle of Vibrio are enter into the host cell. So it's called Vidaloplast. Now stage number four. Filamentous growth of the bidello vibrio bidello last is occurs in stage number four. In stage number four, filamentous growth of bidello vibrio occurs. Right. This is stage number four. Filamentous growth. In your bidelloplast. Now, stage number 6, Bidelloplast lysis and release of a progeny of Bidellovibrium. Stage number 6. Bidello, Bidello plast, lysis, and release of progeny. For example, in a host cell, more than one bidello vibrio are present. In more than one bidello vibrio are present but how this bidello vibrio occurs from this filamentous growth so in stage number four sorry this one is stage number 5. 
in stage number 4 and stage number 5 you can look this this one is a filamentous growth of middle vibrio and this is more than one middle vibrio are formed but how it is possible look at this this one is filamentous middle vibrio right for example this one is a filamentous middle vibrio from this filamentous growth Bidelo vibrio are septation, septet, it means from this filamentous growth more than one bidelo vibrio occurs via septation, via septation, right? So now in stage number six or a last stage this all progeny are liberated so in stage number six Stage number six. Three swimming bidil vibrio are liberate. In stage number six, free swimming Bidelo Vibrios are liberated. Right. So now this all that about life cycle of the daily vibrio right just revise the life cycle of bidello vibrio in stage number one bidello vibrio attached to host cell and then after this bidello vibrio penetrate to periplasmic space periplasmic space of the host cell but which part only and only non-flagellated part here this flagella are loss so in a stage number three bidello plast formation just host cell are round up and bidello vibrio entered into the peri uh, periplasmic space but here flagella are loss and in a stage number four bidello vibrio grow in a filamentous so filamentous grow in a bidello Blast is called to be double blast, right? This one is a filamentous growth, and in stage number five, bidello blast lysis, bidello blast lysis, and release of progeny. But how in between these two stages? Uh, from uh, filamentous growth of the bidello vibrio how this progeny are formed so here septation occurs it means from this filamentous growth uh, septation occurs and more than one bidello vibrio are formed and in the last stage free swimming bidello vibrio are liberated how host cell are lysed for bidello blast are lysed and free genera or the free progeny of the bidello vibrio are formed thank you